The host and the videos of this channel does not represent the U.S. government or any of the federal agency nor any of the branches of the military. It only represents itself as a civilian. On the back roads where the navigators crawl in the swamp land, we ain't worried about no law. You can find me in the woods with my dogs under pine trees in the land of a law. What it is, what it was, what it will be. What up, Dog Pound? This is Triple T. I'm back again with another Dog Pound reaction. So if you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell. That way you know whenever we do a video here on Dog Pound, just trust me. It's one of the realest reaction channels you'll find on YouTube. I can promise you that. And please, watch this video all the way through. Share this video. Get your family and friends to do the same. Leave a comment down below. That way we get built up on the algorithm and the team make channel grow. And I greatly appreciate everybody who's been supporting this channel. It means a lot. I greatly appreciate it. All right, Dog Pound, y'all know the deal. Sit back, relax, strap your boots on, get your dog treats out, and enjoy the ride. Because we're going to jump up into it. Today we're going to be reacting to a new artist on the channel, believe it or not. First time on the channel. First time reaction. And to be quite honest with you, I didn't even know this dude was a daggone artist. So, he sent me an IG message, asked me if I'd check it out. And I told him, I said, listen, we got some rules over here. We don't gas nobody up. If your stuff is trash, hey, we're going to trash it out the door. But if it's gas, oh, we're going to rock it from the floor on up. And ladies and gentlemen, I'm talking about none other than somebody in the community that you all know. It goes by the name of Sasquatch. That's right. Some call him the one-legged bandit. Why? Because he's got one leg. No pun intended. I'm just saying. It's the truth. All right, Sasquatch. And his reply to me was, hey, if it's trash, trash it. But I don't think you're going to trash it. That's why I sent it to you because you said that uh, I think you'll give me your honest opinion. And I will. So Sasquatch, you're up to the plate, my guy. Let's see what you're talking about with a song that you came out with called Hate It. Let's get it. Time out. Hey, I don't know if it's me. I know it's not my sound system. But it seems very, very low. Sasquatch, who did your mix and mastering? Just out of curiosity. We're going to take a pause for a second. Let me see if I can't fix this. All right, we back. Check this out. Sasquatch, hope you don't get mad, my guy, but I kind of took your song and did a little something to it. Didn't change it that much, but I kind of fine-tuned it. I think you might like it. So, let's get it. Oh, yeah. said, look, man, I don't want to be the one that you hate. He said, but I think it might be a little too late. It has been running through my mind by the things you said. And it just don't look too good. I'm, not, I'm going to be quite honest with you, Sasquatch. I, I'm, I'm kind of shocked. I didn't even know you could sing. 
I mean, you got some pretty good vocals. I mean, are they phenomenal? No. But with the right practice and the right coaching, I think you got something here, my guy, for real. Come on. Let's see what else we got. You told me that we were finished after all the BS I put you through. I left you a mess. The damage I left behind. Wish I could rewind. Turn back time. Heal those wounds down deep inside. I wonder what my demons have to say after such a fucked up day. They want to come outside and play, but I want them out their cage. Hold up, hold up, what? What the freaking frack did you... What the Sam Blazing Hockey Stick did I just witness? Damn, Sasquatch. You like the daggone redneck version of Teddy Pendergrass. What the hell? Got some daggone Luther Vandross up in this joint. Next thing you know, you're going to have daggone women throwing panties on the stage at you. Good Lord. Hold up. We got to back that up. I'm dumbfounded right now. Like, I'm in shock. Come on. Play. Told me that we were finished after all the BS I put you through. I left you a mess. The damage I left behind. Wish I could rewind. Turn back time. Heal those wounds down deep inside. I wonder what my demons have to say After such a fucked up day They wanna come outside and play But I want them out their cage Ooh wee, he said, look man <laughs> Man, after such a messed up day My demons wanted to get out and play And I wouldn't let them out the cage That's tough He said, but I always keep thinking about the things That you that I've done to you But he said, just trust me, over time Time heals everything. I just don't want you to hate me. Well, he's definitely he's definitely pouring his heart out. I don't know who he's singing it to, but he's definitely pouring his heart out. Hey, he's getting up in his fields. He's talking about those demons inside of him. He's talking about trying to mend the fence with somebody. I don't know if it's, you know, his woman, kids, a friend, somebody. But I'm digging it. Oh, yes, indeed. I, st I still can't believe this is him. Like, real talk. <laughs> I'm not trying to make fun or anything. But, man, you got my mind blown right now. Let's go. Look, man, I fell down deep inside. I want to make it work, but I can't because I got this daggone... I ain't going to say the word he said. He said he got the curse. Hey, sometimes it gets like that. You feel like no matter what you do, you take two steps forward, you got that one step back. You feel like you got that curse against you. Oh, he's definitely pouring his emotions out on this, folks. Like, real talk. Sasquatch, who are you singing to? I'm just out of curiosity. You ain't got... You know, it's just me and you right now. Ain't nobody listening to this channel. Nobody ever watches me. But seriously, though, who, who are you singing to? The choir in minds want to know. But I'm digging it. I'm digging the vibe. I'm digging your flow. Are, are your vocals, like, on point point? No. But it's definitely not trash. It's not a banger. I mean, you know, you ain't no Jesse Howard or anything like that. Of course, nobody's going to be like him. But what I'm getting at is I'm I'm in shock, like real talk. When you sent me the link, I'm like, oh, my God, this is going to be a nightmare. I do not want to do this reaction. Because every time somebody in the community asks me that I'm going to do a reaction on them, it ends up being trash, and I end up getting into a fight with them. But, bruh. <laughs> you are on to something here. 
I don't know how long you've been singing. I don't know if it's just something that you just like decided to do out the out the blue. But whatever it is, I highly encourage you to keep it going. Because you definitely got something here. And I think you can make something out of it. I'm just saying. I mean, if you could produce stuff like this on a regular basis, oh yeah. You 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 definitely on to something for real. I'm just saying. You got some pretty good vocals. And like I said, with the right amount of practice and coaching, hey, you can be up there. That's just from coming from an old cat. I mean, I ain't no musical genius or anything, but I do have a pretty good ear. I'm just saying. Let's go. I don't want to be the one you hate. I don't want to be the one you hate. Even though it's too late, you always running through my head. Reminding me those last words you said, hey. I don't want to be the one you hate. Even though I fear it's too late. You're always running through my head. Reminding me those last Bruh, you need, nah, man, you got to get back up in the studio and do something. You got to add another couple more verses to this. I mean, seriously, I'm just now getting into it. We just now warming up. Seth, what are you doing to me? Yo, look, like I said, is it trash? Hell no. Is it like a straight up banger? No, but it's got a lot of potential. Your voice has got potential. I like how you, your harmony is. I like your flow. There are some parts that were kind of choppy. Because it's like you ran out of breath. But, like I said, over time, with practice, it becomes perfect. But for your first one, hey, man, I give you an A+. Now, the more you put music out, the stricter those grade that that grade curve is going to get. You ain't going to get that much of a curve because once you start putting music out on a regular basis, we're going to we know, okay, we're going to get more tougher on you. But for your first one, bro, I'm impressed. Like for real. I think you did an outstanding job on this one. I don't know who did your mix and mastering, but uh and I also like to know what you recorded on. What program are you using? Um, the program that I did my two songs on was, uh, let me see if I can, it's uh, Mixcraft 9 Recording Studio. That's where I, I, I took basically took your song, put it in there, just took the lyrics, uh, the, the audio part, and kind of tweaked it a little bit by adding some some equalizer to it, you know. There's there's a lot of things you can do with Mixcraft Nine. I mean, a lot of things. It's basically like a a one stop shop thing. You can do overlays. You can do your your stems. You know, stacking your voice. That's something that you might want to think about doing on some of your songs. Like, there's a couple points in this song that you could have stacked your voice multiple layers to have it like that echo effect that would have flowed really good with it. But like I said, that comes with time and practice. <clears throat> um, if you need any help with it, hit me up. I'm pretty good with Mixcraft 9. Um, New Breed showed, showed me how to do it. He produced my first song, and uh, he showed me a lot of the tricks. So I'm very comfortable with that program. It's not free, but uh, I can show you how to do it for free. You just got to make a bunch of emails. You get 30 days free trial. 
with a, a different email. So <laughs> I've been using it now for the last six months. <laughs> so yeah, I'm about I gotta start another email up so I get another thirty days. Hey, I'm a cheap I'm a cheap man. You know what I'm saying? But look, real talk. I know I'm rambling right now, but I thought you did an outstanding job with this. Like I said, you just got to fine tune those things and it'll come with over time and with practice. But hey, I'll salute you with this one. This is this is dope. I like it. I definitely want more of it. Uh, I wish the song was longer, but it had a good message to it. You could definitely you, you could tell you were singing from your emotions and uh, you're pouring your heart out. And that's what people want to hear. That's what's going to have people resonate to you. When you start singing about songs that people can relate to and you can help people get through the good times and the bad times, that's what people want. So, but I think you're on to something here. I would definitely encourage you to continue doing it. Uh, you get somebody like Mokan, bruh. Well, we ain't gonna talk about that. He should never do music. But you, most definitely. I highly encourage you to do it. Like I said, I'm no musical genius, but I do know a little something. Comes with age. With age comes wisdom. And I I do believe I have a good ear for music. But hey, outstanding job for your first one. Like I said, it's not trash. It's not banger. But for your first one, you did A-okay. All right, Dog Pound, enough of me that I'm going to run in my mouth. But, Seth, you know how to get a hold of me. If you want to chop it up, just hit me up on IG, and uh, we can video chat, and uh, and we can talk about some things. That's totally up to you. And if you want a copy of the, the one that I made, fine-tune it. I'll send it to you if you want. Just let me know. But you all know the deal. Put a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Am I right? Am I wrong? Am I just straight crazy? Should he continue? do music or should he stop put a comment down and let him know and also go to the description of this video click on the original link go over and show him some love tell him i sent you i promise you, you won't regret it all right dog pound y'all know the deal Sip, blah, blah. well i'm tongue tied now anyway i'm out of here you know the deal stay strong stay safe stay blessed i'll see you on the next one you have a blessed one have a great day <laughs> On the back roads where the mountain gators crawl in the swamp land, we ain't worried about no law. You can find me in the woods with my dogs under pine trees.